Also, just thinking about ceramics as a medium is all about metamorphosis. You take earth, soft earth, and you and it and it it's really mimetic. It takes anything that I do. If I stick my fingers in there, it'll hold that impression. And if until I fire it, it will continue to change. Or I could throw it in the water and it'll break down. But once I fire it, it goes through this metamorphosis. This hot uh, kiln changes the thing. And so I think that other aspect of of uh, change is also part of it. Of is a part of my work. That idea of um, metamorphosis leading from one, one thing into another. Uh, I'm Daniel Duford and I um, work in clay, drawings, and I'm a writer. So I was really interested in primitive kilns, so I hand-built the kilns out of clay. And at some point I realized that the kiln was as important as the piece inside. For me, that, that kiln changed, started to be, change my way of thinking about ceramics as not a, it's just a tool to get to this finished piece that you put up and say, look, it's all done, but to think of it as this constant ongoing process. That, and I'm just like looking at a, one of the new pieces I'm working on. This is continuing my interest in, in uh, basically three-dimensional comics and uh, thinking about comics as, uh, as something that has physical presence. I'm returning to my interest in the form of ceramics, the sensuality of these, of these, uh, these storage jars, but then bringing this other layer of, of sequential storytelling and, uh, and looking at the, the vast, vast history of, of two-dimensional imagery on pots. The imagery is of a cremation, uh, and then the other side of the pot is the imagery of a bread oven. So those two, those the transformative effects of fire, I think I'm really interested in. Suddenly you have this, like, in a single thing, a very complex relationship. So then what happens if you have several of these on a table? I think one constant of the American identity is that identity is mutable. And so that, I mean, I think that's kind of something that runs through my, my work. We are always changing when you try to stop something and say, I want to fix my identity in this sense, you actually stop living. And I think life is change.